toot or boot? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Gregory Gage and this is gonna be a very interesting one because I have all of this stuff behind me on my bed. This is gonna be a Donald Duck memories review of the new one, the Christmas one that came out, I mean last year now, but I only just got it. So it's gonna be a toot or boot Mickey or Donald extravaganza special thing. Mickey memories from 2018, Donald Duck memories from 2019. Let's jump straight in. Okay, so I have them right here. The premise of the, the whole thing, toot or boot. It's, uh, <laughs> it's, it's, it's totally a drag race kind of thing. Uh, if you watch a bunch of the drag queens on YouTube, you'll see that there are like toot or boot things. So you have like an option, this or this, then you toot one and you boot the other one. So let's get started. First up, January Mickey. We have the black detailing and the silver detailing on the shorts. He's got all of the embroidery on his arms and everything, all of the embroidery on his bottom and his shorts and his shoes. And underneath, we've got a quote from Walt Disney that says, I only hope that we never lose sight of one thing, that it was all started by a mouse. Walt Disney. So that was a very, very sweet little quote there, right there at the bottom. So yeah, that is the January Mickey memories, uh, which you will have seen already if you saw all my previous videos. But here we go with this one. Now we have the January Donald who is very similar to Mickey, but gold and black. So black and gold. I do love the Donald Duck sculpt. Nice little individual buttons all sewn on there and everything. Very cute, and his one, each Donald meant something different. So this is the first one. Donald wishes you great prosperity, hence the gold. But now we have come to the deciding moment. Toot or boot, what are you gonna say? January Donald or January Mickey? I am gonna say toot to Mickey and sadly boot Donald. And this doesn't mean that I'm throwing away the boots, it just means that Mickey wins. Tooting Mickey because he's Mickey. He was the one that, literally the one that started it all in terms of the whole Disney thing and then also the whole memories collection thing that the Disney store are relentless on <laughs> continuing. Yeah, so toot, boot. Let's take a look at February. Okay, here we have February Donald and February Mickey. They're very, very sweet. Mickey is based on the Art Deco kind of style thing from the 1920s. So he's got like a strange sort of velveteen fabric thing going on. And Donald is, what is Donald? Donald wishes you good fortune. So the difference with the Donalds and the Mickeys is that, aside from January, every Donald has come with an accessory. So this Donald has come with a little fortune cookie right there. But he's very colorful. It's got a pattern on his, on his feet and his jacket with like 2019, but it's in a very Chinese style kind of writing. I'm gonna, hopefully you can see that. I hope that comes up. But yeah, you can see that Donald is very vibrant, very colorful. I do really, really like this Donald. And then Mickey is, he's very vibrant and, and bright and he's cute. I do really like him, but I'm not sure which one I would. I'm gonna toot Donald and boot Mickey. Sorry, Mickey. March, Mickey and March Donald. So the Donalds always had this issue with when they arrived, they had like really, really squished beaks just cause of how they, they arrive, I guess, how they're, how they're posted. But this is a very cute Donald. I love the colors. This Donald wishes you happiness. And that's kind of like the, the color scheme and everything. It's very similar to another Mickey that we have, but not exactly the same. He's very cute. I like the, the light pastel salmon pinky colors that are on him. And then we've got a very, very vibrant Mickey here that's, uh, I, I, I have like bad memories of this because this is when Mickey memories was like really, really picking up and people were just, there was no limit on how many you could buy. And it was just very, very intense. So the whole process of getting hold of this Mickey was far too stressful and for that reason I am booting this Mickey. I don't have good memories <laughs> getting this Mickey memories. And I am tooting the Donald because he's bright and nice and pretty and I like the colors. Okay, let's move on to April. This is based on like the whole aviator style of the 1940s. Uh, so it's, you've got some sheepskin kind of, well sheeps, 
sheep's wool details on him there. Very brown, very neutral. And then Donald, what does Donald do? Donald wishes you a blossoming romance and he's pink and colorful and he's got a little cherry blossom in his, in his hand as a little added extra, which is very, very cute. He's super soft fabric, like really crazy soft. And I, I like all that, that it's got like little hidden, hidden Donalds on there somewhere. You see the little purple outline silhouettes there of Donald. Very, very, very sweet. Toot or boot? Toot or boot? Toot or boot? Toot or boot? I'm going to toot Donald and I'm going to boot Mickey. Sorry, Mickey, you're not doing very well. It's uh, uh, Donald is definitely winning this one. There we go. Toot. Boot. Now let's move on to May. Okay, this one is gonna be a very tough one because I really, really love both of them. So we've got the May Mickey Memories, which was very, very similar to the that previous Donald we looked at. Based on the, it was, I think it was to do with like the science and atoms and the exploration of things from the 50s, I guess. So think about like the Jetsons, I guess. So that's the kind of patterns that we've got on the Mickey memories from May. There's all different like little bits and stars and the things. He's very, very cute. I love his, I just love the whole look of this Mickey. Very, very cute. Love the little pink detailing, everything about him. He's it's just adorable. And then we have the May Donald, which I really, really love. So this Donald wishes you lots of love and you can't say anything bad about that. Look, he's got a little got a little heart as an accessory and I love like the it, like look at how he like shines. It's like a weird satin shimmery shiny thing. It's like a blue but a purple but also pink. So he's a tough one to describe the color of because it's just it changes whenever you're looking at it in different lights. But yeah, so I I, I don't want to boot Donald because he's one of my favorite Donalds, but I don't think I can boot Mickey because he's he's known for being one of the cutest Mickey memories plushes in the, the, in the collection. So I am going to reluctantly boot Donald and I'm going to toot Mickey. Okay, let's move on to June. Here we have June Mickey, the uh, Summer of Love Mickey. This is based on the 60s style that was going around. Like, you've got the tie-dye, you've got the peace and the love in his ears. Very, very sweet. Now this one I do have a really, really fond memory of because Channel 5 were filming a documentary about Oxford Street at the time that this Mickey was released and they did a whole load of filming and they had me like wired up with a microphone. They filmed me walking down the street, going to the Disney store, talking about Disney, why I love Mickey Mouse and all this sort of stuff. And it aired on Channel 5 just before Christmas, I think. Not this Christmas gone, like the Christmas before that. So yeah, Christmas 2018 was when that one aired. And it was very exciting because it was like, it had my name, it had everything and stuff. Oh, if you don't follow me on Instagram, follow me on Instagram. I'll put like the link down here somewhere so you can see. Um, but it actually also aired in New Zealand recently as well, like within the last few weeks. So I had a lot of people like messaging me from New Zealand saying, oh my God, it's you, which is, yeah, very funny. So yeah, I have really fond memories of getting this Mickey and then this one's a tough one as well. So there is the, this is my favorite Donald that is part of the Donald Duck Memories Collection. This is Donald saying, happy birthday, Donald, because it was his birthday. Oh, and that's why he's got a little gift. Right, as much as I love the memory that goes with this, I'm going to boot this Mickey, and I'm going to toot this Donald, because I don't even really need to say anything about him. He's, uh, he's the, He's my favorite Donald. He's in like the sort of classic Donald co colors, but all very, very shiny, very sweet. Love, absolutely love him. He's, I, I really love him. Moving on to the second half of the year, the 70s Mickey Mouse. So he's wearing orange and cords and things. Interesting colors. It's nice to have Mickey being vibrant because it gets a little bit less vibrant as the year goes on. And then Donald, what does Donald do? Donald wishes you a delightful vacation. So Donald is heading off on holiday. He's got his little ring there so he can go in the sea. I mean, he's a duck, he could go in the sea anyway. But still, interesting fabric. I'm not sure what kind of fabric this Donald is, but I really like the color. It's like a really pale pastel yellow, lemon or something, I don't know. And then with all the Donalds, they've all had individually sewn on buttons, which I think is a very sweet little touch. Um, so yeah, I really like this Donald. I like him a lot. So I think, Although, looking at them together like this, I'm looking at them, I can see. I'm gonna boot Donald. <laughs> I've literally just said how much I like this Donald. I'm, I, I'm gonna toot 
Mickey. Toot. Boot. Okay, moving along, and I'm actually glad that I just booted Donald because I'm definitely booting Mickey on this one. <laughs> Here we have the 80s Mickey. This Mickey is, it's with that fabric. So if you got one of the original Belle dolls by Mattel when Beauty and the Beast came out and she had that like gold dress, it's that fabric. So they've used the same fabric they would have used in like the in the 80s, 90s to make this Mickey, which I think is a really, really nice touch. I like how they did all of the different Mickeys was like very specific to what they, they would have been like in in the time period that they were in, in that decade. So yeah, the colors are really cute, black and gold, very much like the original January Donald. But yeah, that is the Mickey there. So let's take a look at the Donald. I have to toot him because he's got rainbows on him. He's going, he's got a little rainbow umbrella. He's got rainbow tassel on his hat. And he's got, he's gonna be playing in like puddles basically is what this thing is. Where is it? Sunshine after the rain. Donald wishes you sunshine after the rain. So he's got these little glittery raindrops all over him, which are very, very sweet. But I, I, it's just the fact that he's covered in rainbows. That's why I'm, I, yeah, toot, 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 toot. Let's move to the next one. Okie dokie, we've moved on to the 90s. Mickey in the 90s. You can see he's very, very, very saved by the bell style. Got those sort of like patterns on him and his shorts and his everything. Very, very, very 90s. Donald, because this was, I think is September? This would have been September? Yeah, September. Uh, Donald wishes you academic success. So it's very, very sweet that he's, he's wishing you that when people are going back to school in September. No one wants to be going back to school in September. But he's got a little workbook and everything. So it's very, very cute. I like that he's got like this pattern on him as if it's like a, like a pattern from a workbook. So you're gonna be doing maths in there or something. I'm not sure. There we go, there's the two of those. I was born in the 80s and I grew up in the 90s. So I am tooting. Mickey on this one. I mean, it's either 90s or homework. Boot the homework and toot the 90s. Okie dokie, we have moved on to October. This is very, very exciting because we're almost at the end. Mickey, I call him Matrix Mickey. He's very, very Matrix themed. In his pattern here, he, it does actually, it says Mickey Mouse in this pattern somewhere. Okay, so on this ear, you can see that it says, it says mouse just there. You're gonna be able to see that, but there, there we go. Mickey, and then underneath there it says mouse, all the way down. So that is the the Matrix Mickey, very, very themed after the, the 2000s, the noughties. Um, and then we've got the Donald here, which wishes you happy travels. This Donald is getting away a lot. He, he's been on holiday, he's been to the beach, he's been all over the place, and now he's going on holidays. Really like the colors of this one. He's very autumnal. He's got like a cord kind of fabric head and body and bum and everything very cute and then he's got all the the it's not actually leaves it's it's uh donald silhouettes but it's made to look like a kind of camouflagey leave thing i am going to ignore that donald's beak is like that right now i am going to toot donald and boot mickey i have a feeling that donald is definitely winning this we are very close to the end now. So we've got the November Mickey, and this was supposed to be Mickey's birthday Mickey because it was his 90th birthday in when this was released. So I'm not gonna lie, I was very... He's nice, but I don't get it. I, I, like, I, I wanted more. I wanted more from, from Mickey's 90th. It's very... I think it's supposed to be like quite bohemian style and everything, or like the boho kind of look. I don't know, it's just a bit too... Although to be fair, it does go really, really nicely with the room. For that reason, that's a plus. And then Donald, the November Donald. So November in China is like their big shopping month. It's a huge thing they do over there. So this Donald is the one that came out last month. Not last month, the month, month before. And he's, he's nice. He's very, very nice. I like that it's, it's like a faux leather pleather, but it's very, very plasticky leather. And then with the gold detailing, and he actually came with a he came with a pin, but we are just talking about the plush right now, not the pin. I don't know, the two of them, I... It's Mickey's 90th, I can't, I can't, I can't boot him on his 90th. So, toot Mickey, and because he goes in the room, and boot Donald. Sorry, Donald. And now, we are on to the very, very final one. So this, I haven't even opened yet. This is the December Donald. Oh, that's cute. There's like a little extra thing in there. And... Oh, he's very sweet. 
<laughs> it looks quite angry, but it's very sweet. So this is the knitted winter Donald. He's he he's knitted. It's it's a knitted fabric. He's got a little Christmas jumper, little candy canes. He's got a little candy cane. He actually looks really cute. He's very adorable. I I really like this Donald. I feel kind of he's kind of glittery as well. He's got little glittery bits in his in his thing. I don't know if that's going to show up, but he is. There is some glitter on there. Very cute glitter. And this Donald wishes you a Merry Christmas. So that is, that's, that's the end of the Donald Duck memories. Here we have the final Mickey memories plush. This was from December 2018, 12 of 12, and I really like it. I love the, um, the iridescent fabric that they've used. It's, it's, it feels odd, but I love how shiny he is, how like colorful he actually is really colorful in the light. I think that's gonna come up, that's gonna show. So you can see all the different iridescent rainbowy colours on that. I really, really do enjoy this Mickey Mouse Memories plush. And then underneath at the bottom, it's got a quote from Walt Disney saying, it's kind of fun to do the impossible, which I think is very sweet. It ties up really, really nicely, the whole collection. So yeah, that is, that's pretty much that. So I feel like I've only just met you and I'm already booting you. I am sorry, Donald, but Mickey definitely wins this one. So there we go. That is it. Boot, toot, we are done. I hope you have enjoyed this tooting and booting video with the Mickey and the Donald. What was your favorite collection? Did you prefer overall the Mickey or the Donald? Let me know in the comments down below and I will see you guys really soon. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it and don't forget to hit that subscribe button as well so you never miss any of my uploads. I will see you again real soon. I'm gonna do a tour of the flat eventually so keep your eyes peeled. I will see you really soon. Mwah. Bye.